Welcome to the Collision Repair Education Foundation Job Skills video series. In this video, we will go over the basics of vehicle setup and measure required to assess structural damage. When a vehicle is involved in a collision, not only do the surface panels sustain damage, but the frame or unibody of the vehicle may be damaged as well. Due to the advancements in vehicle construction and changes in design to accommodate pedestrian safety, what once was considered a minor impact may result in structural damage without the commonly accepted visual indicators, such as gaps. This is why setup to measure is now a commonly required step in blueprinting completion of the repair. Before considering the setup and measure of a vehicle, the technician must review the OEM repair manual for any special considerations or requirements. When setting up the vehicle to be measured, first start off with placing the vehicle on the bench or appropriate rack. Remove any parts or components necessary for the proper placement or access of the measuring device or targets and ensure the vehicle is secure. To create an accurate repair, a three-dimensional measuring system capable of both upper and lower body measurements is required. When using a computerized measuring system, you will first input the vehicle information, such as make and model, into the system. The system will give you the initial setup information and reference points. The system must establish a reference point or area where there is no damage. In some systems, it will allow the technician to continue with only four selected reference points. However, with today's complex vehicle design, the technician using these systems is strongly encouraged to select a minimum of eight points with 12 points being preferable. Once the reference points are obtained, you may now begin to measure the damaged area. Be sure to select as many points as your system will allow and follow components back to your reference points. This will ensure that you have measured all possible areas in which the energy from the collision could have followed along the load path, damaging or misaligning the components. Once the measurement is complete, a report can be generated and placed with the work order for reference. If structural misalignment is noted, the technician can determine if damage can be remedied with corrective pulls or if structural replacement of parts is required. The technician and estimator can work together to complete any estimate or supplement as needed and adjust any delivery dates if required. With the variety of measurement systems and requirements within the collision repair industry, each technician is encouraged to become immediately familiar with the chosen system in the collision facility they are employed at. Thank you for watching this video on setting up and measuring. For more information on the Collision Repair Education Foundation, please visit the website.